Now that we've had our first plausible look at next year's Pixel Fold let's recap everything we've learned about Google's first foldable Pixel. Samsung is the undisputed king of foldable phones, they have over 60% of the foldable market share and don't really have a mainstream competitor in the segment. But that is about to change as Google is all set to launch its own foldable phone the Pixel Fold. We have our first look at the handset that reveals Google is doing foldables better than Samsung in a couple of key aspects. These renders are from John Prosser from Front Page Tech who has a great track record and as you can see the Pixel Fold actually looks good with metal and glass construction. We've been hearing that it will resemble the Oppo Find N more than Samsung's Galaxy Z Fold and that is what we are seeing here. The Samsung Z Fold 4 looks far better cause garden in display selfie shooter but again a 4th gen device versus 1st gen device may not sound like a fair comparison to some. But John Prosser say the Pixel Fold is coming at $1,799 in same price which is the starting price of Samsung Z Fold 4 as well. It's so super highly polished and as of now it only comes in two colors chalk so white and obsidian black. On the outside you have a display that looks like well a pixel display a pretty respectable full display with a 9.5 megapixel hole punch camera on top. We'll have a wide front cover display the edges are flat with slim border and got a nice selfie shooter hole punch on top. Yes I like how the first gen pixel fold got slim form factor and unique finish on back. The main display where things get ugly because we have a thicker bezel on top and bottom chain and I guess I'll use it to place the front facing selfie shooter and top speaker. It will have a unique and smooth folding and unfolding animation and pixel cameras are just fantastic when it comes to daylight and night images. The Pixel Fold is coming with triple camera similar to the Pixel 7 Pro. Ross Young tweeted to advise that the Pixel Fold panel production is going to start in the third quarter of this year. While it was previously expected that we could also see it this year, it's very likely that we're now going to see it at the developer conference in May 23rd, so Google are finally set to release it and it's coming in May 2023. So, without been said, let me know your thought in the comment below, and if you are new here please subscribe, peace out.